What's up, Geek Gang? What's up, Geek folks? How are you good? I hope you are good. Hope everyone is good. We are here. And um, I was about to say good for like a fourth time, but okay. Yeah, you know it is. It, you know what? Um, I think Rebel Moon came out, and it did. You know, it. it I remember seeing. I remember seeing somebody watching it, but mm -hmm. I never get the chance to like stop and do it. I've been so busy. So we about to do it right now. So yeah, let's just, let's get to it. All right. right. You already know Zack Snyder. Rebel Moon on Rebel Moon. Netflix. Netflix. Okay, let's see what's this about. Yep. Do you know the story of the Princess Issa? Damn, Anthony Hopkins is still acting. In the end, she was called the Redeemer. Mm. It was said this child would stop the madness of war. Oh, that looks she good. That she was to usher in a new age of peace and compassion. I was given memories of a world I will never see. Mm. Loyalty to a king I cannot nice. serve. Oh, Griffin, action? And love for a child I could not save. What do you think they want? Everything. I found her. Yeah. They mm. child of war. I was taught that love is weakness. There is a difference between justice and revenge. Mm. Red saber, black box. Mm. There good. is a price to pay for your defiance. I do love this part. Mm. Hold on. I don't want no trouble. We're not here to bring any. Mm. Not yet, anyway. Are you ready? Mm. Yeah. Go. You and I both know fear. Let's show them that we're not afraid. Let's this show them we're more than the shackles that bind us. One hand tied to turn into the The king is a man, and a man can fail. What? But the myth that last is creature? indestructible. Mm. The time has come for all that you love. Protect each other. We show them no mercy. Okay. Who among you is willing to die for what you believe? beautiful. What? I'm here for this. Okay. Can do it. Oh, it's a two-part. Yeah. Oh, okay. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, all right. I can dig it. I can dig it. Netflix gonna eat. <laughs> ah mm. man, it's it's a lot to to dig in. Mm -hmm. Um first thing first, let me just say this real quick. Mm -hmm. Um I the only thing that I can the only thing that I love with Zack Snyder is is, is eye candies. Um he's really good visually. Um his visual attention to details and um his his uh, creative background, you know, his creative instincts with putting movies together mm -hmm. in um, you know in a in a in whatever atmosphere he's making his movie is exceptionally well. Mm. However, the only thing that I do not like with Zack Snyder is um, you about to give them boys. Nah, they it, about to come for you. Listen, it's, it is what it is. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm, I'm, the, the only thing with his movies is that his storylines is always. It's always hit and miss, you mm -hmm. know. What I mean, I, I really did love 
um, 300 um, with Batman vs Superman um, Man of Steel was okay for me I, I think it there's more should have been done. I believe he did Dawn of the Dead. I was a fan of that. Yeah, he's, of yeah he did Dawn of the Dead. He, I, I love that. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, uh, it's, I think uh, Justice League, Justice League, his, his ver- the director's cut mm-hmm. was pretty good. Okay. I, I have to give it that. It was pretty good, but it could have gone in a different way to me. I, I think it could have, it could have been um, dealt with in a different direction. Um, you know, just to set up a, a, a strong strong um story plot everything Mm -hmm. character character development everything um but this no i with this i hope that it comes with a strong story because what everyone is saying is that it it is something that can replace star wars so okay so actually rumor it has it is that this has um Influences from Star Wars. Yeah. Okay, so that's mm-hmm. number one. And number two, you can clearly see that with the the, the lightsaber ish yeah. weapons. Mm-hmm. Um like you also see some things from other um, properties that share similarities like the Griffin or like Harry Potter fans, mm-hmm. the Hippogriff. Mm-hmm. Um you see the eye, if you're into Zelda, it looks like a Sheikah eye. I mm-hmm. mean, like we can go on. The fact that it's also supported by a lot of big stars gives it a lot of clout as like this is gonna be cool i mean listen i love a good fantasy flick so yeah. this like this space opera thing uh rebels trying to free themselves i mm. mean like you even saw a little bit of what i would think is guillermo del toro with that um that like white creature yeah yeah that yeah, feels yeah. very del toro right yeah, there yeah, yeah. so he's, like he, this you know, looks and, and dope he, he's good he's good uh, Zack Snyder is good with monster, if, um, monster. Mm, I mean, effects, again, Dawn of Dead fan, so I agree like with that. that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I mean, like this looks good. I'm pretty excited for this. Yeah. Netflix, like you said, is gonna eat. Yeah, they're gonna eat. They're yeah. Gonna eat. Um, <laughs> there's a lot of Snyder fans that is looking out for this. To what I see on social media, mm-hmm. everybody's kind of crazy for Zack Snyder. Um, he's a very he's a very good director to me, but it's just certain things he's not. I mean, his 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 strategy in, in certain things for me it just doesn't work. You know what I mean? Okay. Probably might work for you guys, but for me, no. Nah. Right. You know what I mean? But this looks good. This looks good. The the the, the visuals looks good. Um, it looks like it have a good storyline. You know, and I hope it's executed properly. If it executes properly, it could be a hit. Yes, for this absolutely decade. for Netflix. For Netflix, you know and I mean? let's get some franchise. Yeah. Because everything doesn't have to be a franchise, but something's good. And it would yeah. be nice to have an original franchise coming up. Yeah. Basically. All right. So listen, I am Lainey. And I'm Jay. Look for us, Geek by Heart. We are on Instagram. We are on X. We are on TikTok. So look mm. for us there. We are on Twitch. I'm on Twitch. Uh, you can look me up as Jay Naral Art. All right. Uh, link in the description below. Check us out. Check me out. Um, you can check out Lainey. With her horror stuff, mm-hmm. you know, and as usual, guys, be a geek. It's never too old to be geek, right? Absolutely. Check us out also on Birth Eye View Podcast. Peace. Peace. Peace.